Okay, hello and welcome to this Java Bucket plugin development tutorial. Um, in this series, what we're going to be looking at is how to create a sort of automatic update checking thingy um, for your plugins. Um, and this is going to be done using the Bucket Dev um, files RSS feed um, that is provided. So the way this is going to work is um, what we're going to do is get the latest version from the download page and compare it to this version here defined in the plugin.yml file. If it's different, we're going to show a little message saying there's an update available. Um, so the idea here is that um, it's like a sort of helper for server admins, I guess, to um, you know notify them of updates. Pretty simple. Um, so just to demonstrate, what I'll do is go across to my server. Just notice here that the version number is 0 0.1. And if we go to my server and just start it up, what we should see is a update notification saying there's a new version available. Um, I'll just wait for it to do that. I've got a new microphone, by the way. You can probably tell I sound different. Anyway, there you go. You can see that the plugin's been enabled, and then it says a new version is available, 0 0.14, which is obviously not 0 0.1, and then it tells you the download link. Just notice that this isn't a download link for this plugin, because this plugin isn't a real plugin, it's just a does nothing plugin. Um, there are a few of those, but you know. Um, yeah, so just don't worry about this download link being different. I just used the RSS feed from one of my projects just because it was easier than trying to think of a way to get around that. So obviously this is automatic, it comes from the feed itself. Um, and if I just, for the sake of example, let's just stop the server and I'll go back to the plugin.yml, we'll change it to point one four, which is the latest version give it a quick export and start it up again and this time we should see that there is no update notification at all however it has still been checked the update um, the latest file has been checked and it um, just found that you've got the latest version and no problems so as you can see it um, didn't give that message again so that's enough of me talking um, so come back for part uh, one if you want to know how to make this